Hi guys, this is Bill from Spencer1984.com with another update to the Nightmare on Elm Street 58 Cadillac. And as you can see, I was not able to get it finished by this evening, but I've got quite a bit done. Uh, you can see I've got all the bodywork done as far as moving the doors, cleaning off the side trim, uh, cleaning up and straightening the rear deck, cleaning off the hood and getting that straightened out getting the sides nice and square and got it in paint which is kind of where I've had to leave off on it uh, as you can see it needs some sanding and polishing but for some reason uh, the paint is taking a lot longer to dry than it usually does so I'm gonna have to give this at least a few more days of gassing out before I can do those final steps on it and from there, move on to the bare metal foiling and other trim work. But in the meantime, did do a little bit more on the grill. Got all the edges cleaned up and re-chromed with a Molotow chrome marker. And painted the black openings. So that's all set. And also have the rear bumper ready to go with the vents painted black, the taillights red, and just a little bit of cleanup where the worst of the rubbing has been. Because this is such an old promo, a lot of the chrome had been kind of worn, but once I washed it, it actually had a kind of nice looking patina to it, so I didn't want to strip and re-chrome it. I'm just going to leave that as it is, and I'm going to do the body to match it. So I'm not going to go with a high gloss finish on the body, but pretty close to the tone that you see here, just smoothed out. And for the top, I'm going to use some gaffer's tape, which has a nice texture similar to the convertible top material. And I'm just going to lay that over what you see here. Uh, I think I mentioned before I'm going to add some ribbing to the steel roof so that it has the right profile with the top on it. But... Yeah, at this point, I'm just waiting for this to dry enough that I can do the final paint work. And then it's just a matter of put the trim on it, put the glass back in it, and put the top on it. So, check back next week for another update. And happy Halloween, everybody. Thanks for watching.